All right, guys, this is Drop It Like It's Scott, and we are out here another Friday evening in the uh, Drop It Wilson family household. We've got the crew here with us today, and what we're going to do is we're going to try these four Patriot food bars. These are the emergency food bars that have a lemon flavor, and they're full of vitamins and minerals with a five-year shelf life. Basically, you just open it and eat it. It's This is a three-day supply right here for you to have for survival food. So we're gonna taste it, and we haven't tasted it yet before, so we're gonna see exactly how this thing is, if it's disgusting, if it's gross, if it tastes good, whatever it is, we're gonna find out. You're trying it first? Yep, I'm gonna open it up. What are you expecting first? I am expecting it to taste like a lemon um, cookie cake bar thing. Okay. So we're just gonna see. Some people it's say it tastes taste like, like shortbread. Butter. It's like butter. AKA lard bar. AKA lard bar. So, well, the only way to find out is to cut it open and see. All right, you guys ready? No. No. I kind of, yeah, actually. Can I see what it looks like? So. <laughs> Stick of butter. <laughs> this is what it looks like. Oh, that is literally oh. just butter with bread. Oh, no, that's much larger than it I looks like a. It looks like a cake bar almost. So, that's it. <laughs> so, here we go. I'm not eating an entire square. No. <laughs> Just P.S. We are not trying it on the square. Lex, would you like to go first? Wait. Um, I mean, I sure. A... That is literally just shortbread. And like, Does it taste good? I think it's fine. Yeah? Let me see those nutrition if I did, If I had to eat it of course, or else I'd die, I would definitely eat it. <clears throat> Pretty good, actually. It's not bad. Be honest, but yet it's kind of good. Okay, so, you gonna eat kinda that? Kind of good. No, oh, I need the whole bar. No, thank you. <laughs> no, thank you. Ringing in at 400 calories, 25 grams of fat. Okay, nobody cares. Just eat it. Grams carbohydrates, 16 grams of sugar, and only three grams of protein. This is not an ideal everyday food. <laughs> That's why it's a survival food. I'm not sure that I would. I think I might rather not. Okay, you're judging the it. by its color. Eat it. Okay. It doesn't actually taste too bad. It has a little aftertaste. Oh, I think I would might get sick if I ate the whole thing. Because of? I don't know. Dad, you eat it. It's just like... Uh -huh. um, it's it tastes like dense, the one at Starbucks. but dry. It tastes like the, the lemon bread at Starbucks. Except it tastes just stale and old. Really what, what do you think the lemon bread at Starbucks <laughs> is? <laughs> okay, your turn. I want to watch. Dad, take a manly man bite. Oh my god, he went for it. <laughs> Kind of the chalky. Yeah. But you know those butter cookies in the tins? Yes. Kind of has that kind of a texture. It does, but it's more dense and stale. More tasting. dense. Well, this is technically supposed to be ideal for like a, day. a meal. Like one per meal? Like one meal, yeah. Okay. Well, don't you need 2,000 calories to survive per day, technically, like on average? And that's only no, I 400. Think it's 1,200. Well, yeah, if you're you. Oh. Yeah. Well, that's only 400, so you need to eat like five of these every so, day to, to yeah. live. Right, so there's three for, for the breakfast, lunch, and dinner, breakfast, lunch, and dinner, breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Yeah. So this is technically three days of food, one bar per meal enough calories for the one bar so i mean do you feel like taking another bite yeah oh yeah take, eat. well i don't know honestly no. go then you guys eat it no you gotta eat what that one what why get sick if i eat this every day this is a way to survive all right mom the best is yours i'm good it never came down to it yeah zombie apocalypse if a zombie apocalypse were to come into play, if a zombie apocalypse were to come into play, and this is the only food you had, 
Yeah, it wouldn't be too bad. It wouldn't be too bad. Honestly, like, obviously, in the day-to-day -day now, you you would care about the nutrition facts and mm -hmm. the calories and all that. But if, I guess if it was life or death, it tastes okay. It tastes more like a snack yeah. than, like, and it, I don't feel like, you know how whenever you go to a restaurant and you're like, oh, that was so no. filling. No. Yeah, I feel like you would get the calories, but you'd be like, that was not feeling at all and you'd feel you'd still have the growly thing in your stomach like where you're like oh geez i need food but yeah. where it's not i cannot okay, swallow I mean, this i hope to have water with it if we have those yeah. but yeah overall I, well, it wasn't as what i expected i expected more um it to be there, greasy mm -hmm. a little bit greasy i think if worse comes to worse I'd eat it. This would definitely be a way to survive and eat something that would give you energy throughout the day or to the next meal, to the next bar. I mean, personally, well, I feel energized. <laughs> well, if, like, you ate, like, absolutely, like, disgusting food before you, like, ever ate that. Look at the camera. Oh. Uh, then, like, it would probably taste good if you, like... Up your heart. So... Something. Worst case scenario, this would help you to have a another couple days of survival. Yeah. Unless the zombies eat your face off. All right. Don't mention zombies. So that's it. This is Drop It Like It's Scott in the crew. Subscribe. Okay, but redo the last part where you say, like, don't mention zombies. Like, why? Okay.